the general consensus about Cyborg's vision is that because they see the world through just one eye, they must see the world flat. But recently, I learned that certain Cyborgs actually traded an eye in exchange for the sense of future vision. And this is why I'm on a journey to learn from a cyborg's vision and find myself stepping into a cave of a cyborg's. As I follow the unexpected into the darkness of the cave, it pokes a hole in the light. <laughs> At a rock that marks a place in time, the camera bends to the left, trapping the last of light behind me. It's dark now. I flicker my eyelids open and close. Hoping that this helps my eyes adjust quickly to the darkness. But the cave remains pitch black. I start to see something new. The absence of light clearly has activated the peripheral of cells of my retina, which now produce their own particular type of gray. This gray color that I can only see when I close my eyes exists in contrast with the actual darkness of the cave. Maybe it will help me to think through different eyes. I'm thinking about an eye that functions as a hyperspectral camera, or maybe even a light field doesn't only absorb, but also emits light. <laughs> My eyes are starting to see more than just darkness, but I'm not sure what I'm actually seeing. Could it be the shadows of the floaters in the fluids of my eye? finally become sensitive to the darkness, then they finally sense a little light that goes through the I look around. It's hard to believe what I see. I'm in a crystal cave in the dark. These crystals that have as their main aesthetic trait the refraction of light. 